Not familiar with turmeric? While you might not have a jar of the spice in your cupboard, it's likely you are already acquainted. It's what gives mustard and curry their vibrant coloring. While a great addition to foods needing that golden hue, turmeric also has anti-inflammatory properties that benefit your health. Registered dietitian Nicole Hopsecker, RD, discusses turmeric's many benefits and shares advice on how to incorporate turmeric into your daily life. First, what is turmeric? Turmeric is a spice that comes from the root of the curcuma longa plant, which is a perennial in the ginger family. Its major active ingredient is curcumin. Curcumin gives turmeric that yellowish color, Hopsecker says. But beware, it stains easily. Try not to get it on your clothing. Turmeric's treasure lies in curcumin's benefits. Curcumin has antioxidants and anti-inflammatory properties. Researchers are investigating whether it may help diseases in which inflammation plays a role, from arthritis to ulcerative colitis. Turmeric Health Benefits The spice, which is easy to add to smoothies and curries, shows promise when it comes to the following health benefits. Number 7. Improves Memory Another clinical trial showed that 90 mg of curcumin taken twice a day for 18 months helped improve memory performance in adults without dementia. Researchers thought that the reduction in brain inflammation and curcumin's antioxidant properties led to less decline in neurocognition, which is the ability to think and reason, Hopsecker says. Curcumin may also have a role in preventing the development of Alzheimer's disease, however, that's an area where we need more research. Number 6. Lessons Pain Turmeric has also deep roots in both Chinese traditional medicine and Ayurveda for treating arthritis. Research suggests that taking turmeric extract could potentially reduce pain from osteoarthritis, though further study is still needed. But I wouldn't rely on a curcumin supplement alone, Hopsecker notes. Medical management should come first. Number 5. Lessons Inflammation Four chronic conditions where inflammation starts to affect tissues in your body, taking turmeric may be beneficial. In one study of patients with ulcerative colitis, those who took 2 grams of curcumin a day along with prescription medication were more likely to stay in remission than those who took the medicine alone. It won't necessarily help during an active flare-up, but it may help prolong remission, Hopsecker explains. Number 4. Lowers risk of heart disease. With its ability to help reduce inflammation and oxidation, turmeric could lower the risk of heart disease. Studies show that turmeric may help reverse the heart disease process. In healthy middle-aged and older adults who took curcumin supplements for 12 weeks, resistance artery endothelial production, which plays a significant role in high blood pressure, was increased. Another study followed 121 people who had coronary artery bypass surgery. A few days before and after the surgery, the group that took 4 grams of curcumin a day saw a 65% decreased risk of having a heart attack in the hospital. Turmeric also may be helpful when used along with medication for managing cholesterol levels. Research shows that curcumin is safe and may protect those at risk for heart disease by lowering certain levels of cholesterol, though more study is needed to look at how much and what type is effective. Number 3. Helps fight depression. If you have depression, the protein known as brain-derived neurotrophic factor, BDNF, is reduced and your hippocampus, which helps with learning and memory, starts to shrink. A study shows that curcumin can boost BDNF levels and may reverse changes. Number 2. Fights free radicals. Turmeric has antioxidant properties and one study shows that it may protect your body from free radicals by neutralizing them. Another study suggests that turmeric's antioxidant effects may also stimulate the action of other antioxidants. Number 1. Helps prevent cancer. Curcumin may affect cancer growth and development according to a few studies. Cancer refers to a number of diseases that all have one thing in common. Cells begin to grow abnormally and spread and harm nearby body tissues. Cancer is the second leading cause of death in the United States, exceeded only by deaths due to heart disease. Many studies have been conducted on turmeric and cancer. Most have only looked at animals or in vitro. Few studies have been conducted on humans, but some evidence suggests that curcumin nanoparticles may slow the growth of cancer cells. Curcumin may even shrink tumor size and weight. Larger studies done on humans are needed before anything can be definitively proven. One study, 
which focused on colorectal cancer, saw a 40% reduction of the number of lesions in the colon in men. That's all for the benefits of turmeric. Now let's talk about the nutritional value of turmeric. While doctors commonly recommend taking 500 mg twice daily with food, the dose that's right for you depends on your overall health. More isn't always better, so talk to your doctor. It's safe to take up to 8 grams per day, but my recommendation would be somewhere on the lighter side, 500 to 1,000 mg a day for the general population, says Hopsecker. For optimal absorption, try taking with heart-healthy fats like oils, avocado, nuts and seeds, she adds. While the risk of side effects is low and drug interactions are unlikely, stop taking turmeric if you notice ill effects. Turmeric may cause bloating, and there is a theoretical concern that it may interact with blood clotting medications. Also avoid it if you have gallbladder disease. Always talk to your doctor before starting a dietary supplement, since they could potentially interact with other medications you're taking. Turmeric can help supplement your conventional care, but it's not a substitute for medicine. No dietary supplement can replace medications or even a well-rounded diet, Hopsecker cautions. If your diet is poor, taking a curcumin supplement isn't going to do anything miraculous. How to use turmeric? You can take turmeric as a supplement or use it as a spice. Curcumin is more potent in a supplement because they've extracted it from the turmeric, Hopsecker says. If you are buying turmeric in the store, it does have some antioxidant properties. While using it as a spice may not have a significant impact, it is a great way to season food without salt. Not ready to commit to a supplement? While cooking with turmeric doesn't give you as big of a health boost, you can still benefit by adding it to smoothies, golden milk, soups, eggs, muffins, roasted veggies. It's one of the main ingredients in a curry sauce. It's potent, pungent, bitter, and very earthy, says Hopsecker. I always think of that curry smell as being what turmeric tastes like. These days, you can buy spiced ground from many supermarkets and spice stores, or you can buy fresh root and store it in an airtight container in the refrigerator. You can then peel and chop or grate to use in your recipes. Is turmeric safe? Turmeric is considered safe if eaten in foods or beverages or applied to the skin. It's unknown if turmeric is safe for people who are pregnant or breastfeeding, as it has not been thoroughly studied in these groups. Some companies are developing turmeric or curcumin products that have increased bioavailability so the body absorbs them better. It's important to remember that reformulated herbs may increase the harmful effects of the supplement. Potential drug interactions. Herbs and supplements, like regular medications, are capable of causing negative interactions if taken with other drugs or supplements. Turmeric is known to decrease the body's ability to absorb certain drugs like medications for cancer or heart disease. The spice may also increase your risk for adverse effects when taken with antidepressants, antibiotics, diabetes medications, or allergy medications. The available evidence does not provide enough conclusions to make any hard and fast rule. It's important to speak with a healthcare provider before starting turmeric supplements. A quick review. Turmeric shows promise as an anti-inflammatory and antioxidant. The spice has possible beneficial effects for people with cancer, metabolic syndrome, depression, arthritis, or other inflammatory conditions. More research is needed to understand turmeric's full effects on human health. Try using turmeric as a spice in your cooking if you like the flavor. Speak with a healthcare provider, especially if you are taking other medications, if you choose to supplement with turmeric or curcumin. Thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, like, share, and subscribe for more health content.